What's going on guys, Silver Fox G37 here, and today we're going to go over the very, very basic data logging procedure of a G37 or 370Z with Ecutech. This is just a very, very basic tutorial. So uh, obviously, you have your Ecutech plugged in the car. I mean, if you're watching this video, you probably already had, know how to do that. So you're going to open up your Pro ECU. Again, this is not how to install the software or anything. This is just focusing on data logging. And I figured this would be kind of a useful first video to the channel. So you have your Pro ECU open. You can start the car. All right, now we'll go to File, Open ROM File. Now this is your tuning file that your tuner sent you. And in my case, uh, let's see, where is it? I'll edit this part out. All right, so base map one, Motordyne, because I'm getting a retune because I installed Motordyne. And there is the tuning file. So open that. And then you have your <clears throat> tables here. So, depending on your tuner, he may ask you to check different boxes on what he wants to look at. So, in my case, go to all parameters. Let's see, scroll down a bit. And my tuner asked for custom map G into rim. Where is it here? There it is. and engine oil temperature. And now we are ready to data log, which will come up next as soon as I get to my test road, as I like to call it. Also, make sure you click Map Access. And this will actually start the, uh, not the data logging, but it won't record anything yet, which I will show you how to do next. All right, so I found my uh, stretch of road that I like. And so now that you have the data logger running, uh, we're gonna start the data log recording. So to do that, we're gonna simply hit log to file. And you can see not screen. So now we're recording a data log. So now my tuner asked for a 3000 RPM third gear pull up to rev limit, full throttle. So that's what we're going to do. So wait for this car to pass. All right, here we go. Get up to 3,000, give or take, and then punch it. All the way up to the rev limit. Start the data logger by clicking log the file again. And it turns red. And I'll show you how to retrieve your file. I apologize in advance. Uh, this is my first YouTube video I've made in a while. Uh, I used to have a channel for a different car. But uh, so this please bear with me. This is just my first video just to kind of get something started. So anyway, uh, once you click log the file, uh, it's going to save your data log. So now what you do, hit map access again to stop the data logger. Um, we'll get out of this then you're gonna want to go to your file explorer your PC or C drive and then go to your Ecutech folder and go to map access logs and make sure that you select the correct data log so in this case today is the 3rd of August so this is uh, the one right here. Now basically, uh, you take that file, attach it uh, to your email, and then send that file over to your tuner. And then uh, it's basically just a repeat process and uh, just doing what your tuner tells you and only doing one of each action because otherwise you're gonna really confuse the hell out of your tuner if you're doing uh, each action more than once. So basically just do one of each task do what the tuner tells you 
and be patient with this e-tuning because tuners are busy. Uh, be very patient. So hope this was helpful and if you liked the first video give it a thumbs up and uh, I'll get better at this. I used to do this a lot, uh, I just haven't done it in a while and um, yeah there will be plenty more videos to come.